Hello and welcome to Wise Guys Entertainment. This is your host Wyman. I am doing another one of those uh, background check videos. It's your opportunity to get a glimpse into just how I got sucked into a given fandom. For example, movies, music, cartoons, comics, toys, franchises. And today we're going to briefly discuss BBC TV. Uh, BBC is British Broadcasting Center, I believe. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, and is basically British television. And uh, is basically awesome comedy. If you haven't ever seen it, check it out. Um, the ones that I saw that I watched the most of were, let's see here. Chef, which is uh, about this married couple, and the husband is a chef, a uh, professional chef in a restaurant, and, oh man, it's just so cool. Uh, let's see here. Another one is May to December. Uh, it was a considerably older gentleman uh, who was in a relationship with a younger woman, hence May to December, May being, if I'm not mistaken, May represents, you know, like springtime and uh, youth. So that represents the younger woman versus uh, December, which is like winter aged. And that represents the older man. And they just had such great chemistry and uh, they had such good comedic timing. Um, Doctor Who, uh, well, Doc, let's see, how long did I follow Doctor Who? Um, I think I started somewhere around the fourth or fifth Doctor, and then I went as far as the 10th or 11th. I never got into the very latest when they decided to revamp it and change the Doctor Who to a woman. I mean, I'm not so concerned about them doing a gender swap, but it seems so forced and contrived that it just didn't interest me from the get-go. And uh, from all the reviews I've seen on it, it's a dumpster fire. So I'm glad I didn't watch any of it. Uh, let's see here. And I trust the people who have reviewed it. Red Dwarf is freaking comedy gold, and it's uh, kind of like comedy plus sci-fi. Uh, almost, uh, I don't know if you'd call it campy sci-fi, but it's it's funny. Uh, and Black Adder. Uh, now, if I'm not mistaken, that uh, <laughs> I really need. <laughs> I, need, I really need to do refresher courses on these topics I'm covering uh, just to make sure I got my facts straight. Um, but Blackadder, is, if I'm remembering correctly, is uh, where Rowan Atkinson, uh, the actor who many of you may be familiar with as playing the character Bean, um, he is actually playing the son of death death himself and uh, the premise is he is um, he being the son he, he's not too fond of you know killing you know bringing uh, people to death's doorstep so the people he's assigned he actually takes some time getting to know and everything and uh, almost bonding with, but uh, it's pretty epic. Um, there's a series, well, I've watched uh, some of Upstairs Downstairs, but I didn't really gravitate towards it, but it's kind of cool. And uh, Waiting for God, where this uh, 
uh, this crotchety older woman is uh, in like a senior retirement community. I mean, BBC <laughs> releases so much good content. It, it's just astounding. Uh, but it seems like um, they only run it for several seasons with exception to things like uh, I guess Upstairs Downstairs and well Red Dwarf for a while and uh, Doctor Who they terminated the series after uh, a certain number of seasons and then they go on to something new and uh, which is an interesting way to do business I mean, it's not necessarily bad. It's just I, I wish things had lasted longer. Like May to December, I was really into, and Chef, I was really into. Um, yeah, so that's uh, a glimpse about uh, BBC Television. So, thanks for uh, hanging out with me. Uh, this is Wise Guys Entertainment. Uh, be sure and like, comment, and subscribe on the notifications bell be sure and mark all notifications so that you get everything it also helps my channel out thanks so very much and you have a great day